this is an aloe vera soap this soap contains aloe vera vitamin e basil leaf and the aloe vera in this soap will clear your acne will clear scars remove blemishes vitamin e also face dark spots the basil leaf removes black heads, acne scars and pimples so this soap is very good for you if you know you have acne i call this soap aloe vera soap so and it's a diy you can do it on do it yourself do it at home by yourself okay so if you want to find out how i made this soap keep watching tables have turned now i'm up all night i'm picturing you acting like a fool please welcome back to my channel it's my david here and if this is your first time for joining my channel you're welcome thank you so much for clicking this video and this is your first time you're welcome back to my channel guys don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed okay and today in this video i am going to be showing you guys how to make soap how to make your homemade soap by yourself you don't need to stress yourself okay this soap is very very easy to make and it's very very good for the body okay so i'm going to start by this thing right here this very transparent soap right here is my base soap i'm going to be using it's called glycerin based soap if you want me to tell teach you how to make glycerin based soap leave it down in the comment section let me know if you really want to learn how to make it but if they sell already made of this in the markets or anywhere you can get this okay this is glycerin based soup. i'm going to be cutting this into smaller pieces let's melt this soap i want to melt it i want it to be a melt to be in a melted form this is how we look i'll be adding an aloe vera gel guys i'm going to be using this is my aloe vera gel i'm going to be using one tablespoon of aloe vera gel Guys, don't mind that noise. It's raining and <laughs> it's raining heavily here, yeah, right here, as I'm doing this video. If you're hearing any sound, it's the rain. Okay. So I'm using one tablespoon because this this particular measurement is half tablespoon. I don't know if you guys can see this. It's half tablespoon of um half tablespoon of aloe vera gel so i'm going to be using i've kept one day so now it's going to be one tablespoon of aloe vera gel inside this mix so the next thing i'll be adding is vitamin e vitamin e oil half teaspoon of vitamin e oil i'm pouring this inside my mixture so guys let's stir it together you can see it's changing already this is just aloe vera gel and vitamin e oil and this is the consistency it's going to give you so the next thing i'm going to be adding is my basil leaf I'm going to be cutting this into small and I'm not really doing anything serious with this one so this is what I'm just going to be doing with this so guys this is the soap mold we'll be using if you don't have a soap mold don't need to worry about it you can use a container you can use um like yeah a container a cream container any small container that you feel the soap will fit in in but i'm using a soap mold today and this is if you but if you have a soap mold it's also very good i'm using a soap mold today and first i want to line this side with my olive oil why am i putting olive oil at this side is because i want it i want the soap to be 
very easy to remove once it's already frozen okay the soap is just going to take one side i'm not doing plenty soap as you can see it was small quantity i i used okay 